And they're going to Smashville anyway. Yeah. Which is common. The classic. Yeah, the classic. Three, two, one, go! Now, how do these sets usually go? These guys played here before? I don't think I've ever watched these guys play before. Okay, so we're but something new. But bread and butter down there forward air. They're from Peach. I think that is the kill setup at higher percents. Yeah. Uh, maybe maybe with only like certain DI or something. I'm not sure. Yeah. But David loves his space back airs. He's gonna use them all game. Yeah. Spacing back airs is the classic, and he loves that helmet up too. The uh, you know that's actually a really good option in this match. Peach is in the air a lot. She's floating. Um, fall down on that invincible head. Yeah. Definitely. Great way to challenge her, her approaches with the float. Um, pretty even game so far. Uh, Oscar awesome. gonna hang on that platform. Looking content to just pull out these turnips, but he's uh, giving up stage control and he's taking some damage for it. Yeah, for sure. Now, both these characters being relatively light, um, I, they're, they're both gonna die early, I mean. Okay, good fair. Nice uh, movement mix-ups here from Awesome Cakes. Just running around, using his float and canceling it I like, I like very the, well. Yeah, float cancel on the ground, that's good. Get up, air. <laughs> and he dash attacked him into the turnip. That dash attack almost killed. And he almost set up that turnip really well. It looked like it, looked like it was going to hit the balloon. It was a nice bear. Yeah, good bear there to seal the stock. Um, Let's see if David can uh, get some damage in here. Yeah. Spaghetti, for a grab. yeah spaghetti from both players. <laughs> Random side B at neutral. Another side B. Okay, that was going to be punished. Oh, one pommel. Nothing it comes out of it. Good air dodge. I think the upper probably would have killed. Yeah, I think that's hard to get on Peach though, with her being floaty. Um, yeah, oh. he's waiting for the air dodge this time. Yeah. But uh, the space is the air, the uh, the up air. You can get the kill with it. And that's two that's two downers that Austin Cakes has uh, managed to get. And it looks like both times he's going for the fair again. Yeah. But really uh, good damage. David's oh. getting popped out on the other side and it's just ca catching him off guard. He has to pay uh, a little bit more attention. David has to hit and run and get some damage. Yeah. Okay, that's not the way to do it. Okay. Ooh, he's dead. Oh, fair at fair kills. Wow. I okay, good stuff to awesome. I kick. think he might have been holding away, or maybe yeah. it was just the poor DI. It looked like he was trying to run, like yeah. run away. And yeah. yeah. Sorry. Game one, awesome kick. Now. Where do you go for a counter pick? I, I've seen David. Uh, David likes to go to Battlefield. David loves Battlefield. That's game watch. He loves our edge guarding. But I mean, you can't really edge guard Peach too yeah. much. I, mean, I think David also likes Lilat. Like, I think it's good for a game watch. Yeah. Um, oh, are we seeing the Battlefield? And I feel like Lilat would be a good pick because usually a lot of Peach players, they don't like Lilat because the, uh, yeah. like the tilting and the slants, they kind of mess up their uh, the float, the float spacing sure. and, and the recovery. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. All right, so we are going to Battlefield. Gaines called it. Always right. Let's go. Gaines is always right. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, David told me before he likes Battlefield because he likes he likes the edges. He likes the edges. He likes going off. He likes being able to, you know, pressure there. Um, and he also loves the platform, so. Mm -hmm. I mean, him being the lightest character in the game is probably not a bad option to live a little bit longer. Oh, tries to go down for that back air, but gets clipped by the FB. David looking to chase here. Gets her with that up smash. Ospik having a hard time landing right now, getting back to stage. Yeah. He's been in the air for a long time, yeah. either in the air or at the edge. For sure. Uh, David's maintaining stage control really well. Good fair. Okay, Austin Kick realizes he has some space. He has some space, pulls out a turnip. Down throw. Not does not to go for a turnip, I don't know about that. You guys are spacing each other out right now. Footsies right now, yeah. David keep going deep. It's game and watch life. David lo will go deep. Okay. Potential edge guard. There you tech? go. Yeah. Okay. No tech. Those multi-hit moves can be a bit tricky. He's told me. He feels so much more comfortable off the stage of Battlefield than any other stage in the game. I don't know why, but it's working out. I think it's because the stage, oh, the stage is so much higher above the blast zone than it is on other stages. I think so. Too. That like since he feels like he's not very close to the bottom blast zone, he doesn't feel like he's in danger. danger That's probably yeah. what it is. For sure. Right now, this is looking like a completely different game from game one. David uh, just looks a lot more comfortable. Well, he tries to read that side view with the out smash. Ooh, catches him again with that fair, but those not blast, those blast zones saving him. I yeah. Think. Drop shield and forward tilt there against David. David loves to use that ledge option, just the regular yeah. get up and the run back off stage. Run back off stage. Yeah. It's so quick, 
It's uh, it, it really is just catches you off guard. Okay, just runs in there, gets the dash attack. But good DI from David, right into the corner. He's gonna live that. Right now, you see awesome cake. Flow canceling him by the ledge, looking for that fair, looking for a dash attack, trying to get that stock. David trying to get awesome kicks to run off the platform, or hoping he's gonna run off the platform for so sure. he can fall into that up smash. Up smash, yeah. And awesome kicks have been air dodging almost every time after that down throw, and yeah. David has he's caught onto it, but not once has he uh, gotten the actual punish. That bear is still living. There you go. There we go. Okay. That's a two zero victory. That's for a two slot. That looks that looks solid. That looks solid. That is awesome kick ban. Mr. Because of platforms? No, now, now it's David's turn to ban. Because he just won. Oh, yeah, sorry. That's um, right, right. I feel like David's strengths definitely rely on platforms. And yeah. Because he had an awesome case in the air for a long he time did, there. He did. I think FD or uh, okay. yeah, Town of City would be good because he got that early kill with the fair once. That's he probably true. wants it again. Yeah. Um, Low blast zones. And there, there are platforms. Um, they do move, in, but they are there. Now, you know, Awesome Cake's also probably thinking, okay, you know what, I killed him with a fair really early on Smashville. He can die really early on this stage, too. Yeah. He's got more room to run around on the ground. Nice. Going for the Nair instead. I like that this time it looked like he reacted to the direction he went in. Definitely. Rather definitely. than just uh, aiming for the fair and then, like, if it doesn't work, then it's too bad for him. For sure. Oh, good catch. That, that up smash is so good. I wonder if we're going to see Awesome Cake try to challenge that up smash with the, uh, the Peach Neutral B. Rather than continu okay. continuing to land with uh, aerials. Would that work? Yeah, it's a counter. It's it's a counter. counter. It would, the counter will work? Okay. Trying to combo off the turnip, but not the right angle. Ooh, these dash attacks on shield. And these are missed punishes here from Awesome Kicks. He's, uh, he shielded two dash attacks. That was that was really good by David. Yeah. Down throw, waits out the, the air dodge. Yeah. yeah awesome Kicks stuff. the whole time has been uh, air dodging that. That's right. David waited for it once the first game, but then he missed it. And this time, I think he was a little bit more patient. Yep. Uh, knew it was going to happen and just got in there with the right spacing and got that kill. Now, can Awesome Case bring it back? Can he... Okay, David really feel, feeling himself looks like. Trying to stage spike him at 15. He's going for the super early kills. He's going for an empty full hop into grab. Okay, good down throw up there. But David is nearing kill percent, especially for, like, on Town and City with such a light with character as Game Watch. Yeah. One fair might, uh, might be the end of this stock. Good fair. If that was, if that, I think if that was that, that was the, the ledge, it was, it was done. You know what? What I'd like to see it, Awesome Case do, if possible, is that uh, David hop, hops around a lot in neutral. I'd like to see him catch a jump. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> I've never seen a kill like that before. Just boop, gone. You know, Awesome Case is the Peach player, so he knew that was gonna kill oh, him if he got, if he got up with it. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> that is hilarious. Now, actually got a lot of knockback. Now Awesome Cake's got to be careful because he's in the air again. David's going to look for that up smash. Yeah, he's got to land. Okay, back to stage. Oh, he reacted, unfortunately. Just uh, Yeah, a little too slow. Yeah. There it is. And that's it. Yeah, that's a 2-1 victory for David underscore Gibbet. Yeah. You got to really be careful in the air with that invincible up smash. Good yeah. stuff to David, though. Taking that 2-1.